this photo is from 2011 um, around Christmas time um, and I was I had just left China after my um, semester abroad in um, Shanghai and I was heading off to France and I hadn't gotten a relaxer the entire time I was in China so I had so much regrowth and I just figured why not this is the time to big chop so um, I cut all my hair off I wasn't happy with the first um, haircut I had but I got another I did like two haircuts basically to get it down to the the, um, the length that I liked and I wanted and um, yeah I had a great time studying abroad in the south of France in Aix-en-Provence um, and I thought it looked pretty freaking cute as you can tell I was just really feeling myself it was something different something interesting and um, it was really freeing not having to keep an appointment to get my relaxer redone every six weeks at about a hundred bucks a pop each time not to mention it took a good three or four hours just waiting and um, you know having to maintain it you know you get your blowout and then you can't take a shower you can't go swimming you can't sweat it out um, so it was just really really nice um, being able to study abroad, focus on my studies, and, um, and not have to worry about my hair. Um, I absolutely loved it, and I felt really confident doing it and being able to take care of my new natural curls, um, just because there's so much more information out there. Um, YouTube and blogs and information about how to take care of your natural curly hair. Um, you know, we're really, really lucky that we have um, all that information available. So if you want to save some dough, you want to save some time, um, it's a really great option to, um, to go natural. And um, I absolutely loved it. And I am thinking about going uh, short again. But the best part is knowing that my identity and my confidence and my beauty is not connected to the length of my hair or how straight it is. So. That was a really great opportunity and I'm really glad I did it. Thanks for watching.